Last year when we first moved here, we started rehabilitating a rainforest remnant around a beautiful rainforest creek. We've done a lot of work. Want to see how far we've come? That noise was um, orange-footed scrub prints flying off. I've surprised them as I've come through. So you can see the path is a lot clearer. We still haven't fixed up the steps that got damaged at some point before we moved here. You can see there's a lot more light down here now. We've cleared out a lot of vines and a lot of invasive plants. Still working on that. We're keeping some of the vines, but the vines are actually restricting the growth of the other plants, which is why we're getting rid of them. Now, I just saw a carpenter bee flying out of here. She can see there's a lot of old wood there. She's probably making a nest in there somewhere. So this is the pathway and I used to have to go through there but now we've cleared this whole section and we're in the process. You can see there's a massive lot of wait a while there and we'll keep the wait a while in some places because it's very important to this particular habitat but we're going to get rid of as much of it as we can around the areas that we want to use. Here we are down the new pathway. You'll see there's a tree in the middle of the pathway. I want to identify this before we pull it out because there's a chance that it's an endangered one. We've been working on creating some rock steps along here. Just finding it difficult to balance because I'm carrying my camera with a mega lens. And here we are, this is now where we enter the beautiful creek area. From this angle you can see how much work we've done. All this, this log chopped up and moved across like that is to redirect water to stop it from uh, washing away the path. We're trying to leave the old wood as much as we can because we know it's very important to the local ecosystem. So what's next? Well, that cleared out area, I have butterfly trees and butterfly vines ready to go there. There's going to be a table placed in that area so that we can enjoy the creek while the kids play. And I'm basically just picking up local trees that I know fit in this kind of environment to fill out all those sun spaces so that we can get a canopy back in there as quickly as possible. Thanks for watching. And if you want to see more of what we're doing with our little piece of paradise, make sure you hit that subscribe button, like this video if you liked it, and feel free to share with others. See you next time. Keep on growing. Oh, sorry, it puffed up. I'm carrying a huge camera. It's made me very puffed as I've gone back up from the creek.